everybody, welcome to V Beauty Online. It sure is a beautiful day here in Texas. I hope you guys are doing well. Um, I have promised you guys that I would do a collective haul of the products that I have acquired over the last six months that I've been gone. And this is part one. And I thought I would have my helpers here with me today. Um, some girls that I babysit. So they're going to be handing me the products as I discuss them. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Okay, first off, I got a coupon in a magazine. Um, I think the magazine is called All Yours or All For You, something like that. It's a really cute magazine. They sell them at Walmart. And they had a free uh, a coupon for a free Rimmel eyeshadow. So I just got this last week. It's a uh, Color Rush Trio eyeshadow. It's got three colors, a silver, a plum, and like a granite color and I love this for like nighttime going out and let's see I've also ordered some Avon I have a lady that lives uh, around the corner that sells Avon and we buy from her every once in a while so this is one of the palettes that I got from her this is just kind of like all colors of the rainbow palette and I know this is in the current Avon books right now and the rest that I got from Avon, I got, these are some neat little doozies. Um, I don't know if you can see this. These are those press-on eyeshadows that you just put up against your face and you press them on. These are fun. I don't recommend them. Um, they're great for kids. They're great for running around the house. But they're more, they're more of a pain in the, in the booty than anything else because they're not that easy to apply and they are not that pigmented. So I really... Don't recommend these for you, but um, like I said, for kids, they're fun. They're something to do. They're kind of neat. So I just had to try them. Okay, and these are two more Avon products that I purchased. These are quads. Um, I really like these. They're kind of new. And let's see. This one right here is called the Smoky Eye Quad. It's got four colors. It's got a pink, a white, a granite, and a silver, and it's got some shimmer to it. Um, you guys, these colors are not too pigmented, but they're okay. They're good. They're not, um, I wouldn't rate them a 10 out of 10. I'd rate them about a 7. They're pretty good. Um, this one right here is Earthy, Earth Tones, and it's got a green, a off-white, like a sunset gold, and a dark plum right there. I really, really like this one. The dark plum is actually pretty pigmented. They're really cool for just everyday usage and wearing around the town, going grocery shopping. Then um, again, I wouldn't wear them when you're going out um, dancing or whatever because they're not too pigmented and they do come off easily. All right, I think that was, was that all the Avon girls? Okay. And on to Ulta. You know that Ulta is one of my favorite stores, so I got this. This is the Bad Gal Lash in blue. And this actually is really cool. I like the brush. The, um, the applicator is great. It does show up dark blue, which I like, so it is pigmented. The color does stay. No. Yeah, but it's a, it's a navy blue color. It's pretty awesome. It's for fun. Um, I also got some Bare Minerals. I love this stuff. Um, I do also like the Mary Kay Minerals. But the Bare Minerals is becoming one of my favorites as well because I can just kind of throw this on and go. It doesn't require much work. Just get a kabuki brush and, and let it go. My hair is going all over the place today. I apologize. Um, what else from Ulta? Okay. I got a Bat Gal by Benefit. This is Face bright Brightening Primer. And it's just a stick just like this. And it just twirls up and it's got primer in there that's supposed to illuminate your face. I have not tried it out yet, you guys, so I cannot judge on the product, but it looks pretty cool. Looks like a stick of Elmer's glue or some sort. Okay, I also got brush cleaner from Ulta. I've not tried this yet. I'm going to do a video with this to uh, show you and myself how it works and if it's worth buying or not. So that's that. See how much time we have. Okay. All right. I'm into foundation primers, or I was into them for a few weeks there. This is Prime Time by Bare Vitamins. This is also something that you apply underneath your foundation. 
Um, it really helps to let the foundation stick, soak up oils, so on and so forth. This works really good. I really enjoy it under my minerals. Now the next thing that I got, um, I used to do this, the nail teaks when I was younger. This is formula number two. This stuff can strengthen your nails and make them grow in a week's time. I swear by this stuff. This is what it looks like. It's just clear polish that you apply to your naked nails and it gives it a nice shine and it also helps them grow. I usually do one to two coats per week. All right, the last thing, or no, yeah, the last thing I got from Ulta is high beam, Benefit High Beam. I have done some research on this and I've heard that it's a really good product. I have not used it yet. I haven't had anywhere to wear it yet. It looks like nail polish. It is a uh, highlighting, illuminating uh, stuff that you put on your face that comes in this nail polish looking thing and you just apply it to wherever you need a little bit more shimmer and a little bit more highlight on your face. All right, this right here I got from a friend. It's Mario Badescu. Um, I don't know if you guys have ever been to their website, mariobadescu.com, and I'll put a link down there. They have actually really good skincare products. I have not used this one. I'll have to do a review on it. This is the uh, Kira Moisturizer um, skincare product. So it's supposed to be really good, really healthy for age defying without uh, drying out or making your face too oily. All right, three more things that I have acquired that I can show you today in the allotted time are three things from Victoria's Secret. This is the Bare Bronze collection right here. I don't know if you can see it, Bare Bronze. And this palette, it does not have a name. It doesn't have a name on the back. It's just eyeshadows, and they're gorgeous, you guys. Look at those colors. They're nice neutral browns thrown in with some copper and some burgundy red right there for a little touch of just glam. It's awesome. I love it. And this right here is another one of the Bare Bronze palettes. And this is what I'm wearing right now. I just put a little bit on. I didn't go hog wild with it. But this is the blues. Um, this has to be my favorite one that I have right now. It's got like a brown, a taupe, uh, aqua, chocolate brown, and a light sky blue up there. It's really shimmery. I love it. I think these are beautiful, beautiful colors. Look at that. Again, that is the Bare Bronze collection. And I have one more of the Bare Bronze that is an all-over cheek and lip color quad here. I've kind of messed it up because I'm wearing it right now, and I just kind of rub my fingers around in it. But it's got a lot of nice rosy colors to it as well. The girls wanted me to show you this. They have the ID Mineral Veil um, saying it's that it's, so it's a light color.